125 million people continue to be exposed to asbestos in the workplace. So there's a big cost to you in using asbestos in dollars and lives. Research that goes into these decisions has to be directed by independent, unconflicted scientists. It's not something that just affects workers, it affects everyone. Saving one life is great, but saving many more is what I hope to accomplish. Making a profit off of people's pain and lives is wrong. We can't quit, not as long as there are hundreds of thousands of people still to be diagnosed. Ban the asbestos once and for all. This conference year after year impresses me so much. There are so many people from all over the world and yet we've all got one message and that's we want to ban asbestos and achieve justice for those victims. The Asbestos Disease Awareness Organization has been one of our strongest allies in this fight. That this has been a good ride. We've had 15 good years and we've grown into a viable organization that is known worldwide and we are making a difference. Being in rooms like this with people like you who remind us how important it is to just keep this fight going and how we can win. This story, the first the story of Libby and then the larger story of asbestos, is the most affecting story I've worked on in 50 years in journalism. My goal has been simple, to provide workers with honest, fact-based answers about what has happened to them at work and what they can do going forward to protect their health. You're making a statement that what has happened is wrong and you will not stand for it, so thank you. You're the voices that sing about justice to the world, whether it's from Brazil to Nigeria, Canada, England, the United States, and every other country that's been represented at these conferences, all of you are making a difference and it's a big impact. What do we want? We want to ban asbestos worldwide. We have been able to really conquer things that no other little tiny organization could. And guess what? There's more. There's a lot more. Thank you all for what you do and, ins and the inspiration that you give us.